Latrice and welcome to my channel. So today we're going to film a get ready with me. I'm going to show you guys my everyday makeup routine. So it's been pretty tried and true for a little over a year. You know, I like to switch things up here and there, but I would say I've been pretty consistent with this makeup routine. So definitely wanted to show you guys in case there's some new things that you want to add to your beauty bag or some things that you have in mind for me for mine, just given what you'll ultimately see. So yeah, let's get right into it. Hey y'all, so you see me here now with a fresh face and bare skin. And what I'm about to do is apply a base primer. I'm gonna do the Super Goop Glow Screen because it is not only a sunscreen, but it has this really nice like pearlized glowy finish that shows up extremely well under foundation. Next, I'm gonna take my Bobbi Brown foundation in the color Warm Golden and apply it to my skin. To be honest, I lost my brush, so I am applying with my fingers, but I do like a finger application. It looks really, really natural, generally speaking, and I do not apply it to my forehead. I don't know what's with that. I just, that's not my vibe. It's a little bit much around the forehead for me, so I always leave that area out personally. Next, I'm grabbing my NARS concealer in the color Caramel. I just really like the brightness that this adds to the face. It just gives you like that light, really like bright eyed look that I am always going for with my concealer. And hello, Beauty Blender. So we're gonna take that and blend everything out real nicely. Yes, we are. And to top off my pre-existing concealer, what I'm gonna do is apply the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Concealer in the color 45. I love this. It just gives you that finished look. There's something about it that's so nice. And when I did some research and talked to a lot of the experts at Sephora, they were like, this one is just great for photography, videography, any type of thing. If you wanna just like capture yourself, this is good for that. So this is why this one has always been tried and true in my collection in addition to the other one. So next, I'm gonna grab my Laura Mercier Under Eye Brightening Powder in the color two. Y'all, this is one of the real MVPs of the makeup bag. When I tell you no creasing, and I use it for so much more than just my under eyes, it just sets everything off right. Set it off, Jada Pinkett! Next up is my Black Radiance Foundation Stick in the color Espresso. I use this to contour my face. Now, honestly, I don't do too much when it comes to contouring because I already have pretty defined facial features, but I just love it to really bring them out even more. We're gonna blend everything out, and at this point in the game, I'm just having a really good time because, listen, it is a necessary evil, and I wouldn't even call it an evil. Like, it is part of the game, and it makes everything look so amazing when you are finished. Now I'm grabbing my Bobbi Brown Bronzer in the shade Deep to really warm up my skin and give me a little bit more color and make everything look that much more natural and settled. Anastasia has now entered the building, y'all. Peach Fizz Liquid Highlighter is, woo, child, it's just life. It looks so good. I use it for like this really glowy finish to put underneath the powder highlighters of mine. And oh my goodness, my makeup and face would not look the same without this product. It just wouldn't. It just sets it off. And now enters the OG. So this is from the Karuchi ColourPop collaboration back in the day. It was called Glow Up and it is such a great highlighter. Now for the brows, Anastasia and Benefit always hold me down. I'm not gonna keep this part long because it takes a while to do your brows, but y'all see what I use. I will have the shades linked at the bottom. Now I'm doing a little dance because we are almost there with this makeup, yes. Now I'm gonna hit these lashes with the benefit they're real love this oh, i've been using this for years it is part of my like trifecta of mascaras but benefit they're real is what really changed the game for me now it's time for the milk beauty setting spray 
And then of course my clumsy self got it in my mouth. Oh, this is nothing new y'all, just bear with me. Now we have our trio, our lip liner, our lipstick, and our lip gloss. Woo, if y'all don't do this, I don't know what y'all doing over there. I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. But for real, I love this combo. Now we really gonna get up in there and blend it out, sis. Yes, mm, yes. Finally, I am grabbing my Makeup Forever setting powder. It just gets everything looking super finished and eliminates a lot of the shine. I love it. Now we gonna take a little minute to Vogue because everybody loves to see those beauty shots when it comes to a get ready with me. So here we go. So this is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and perhaps maybe learned something new, but I feel like my beauty routine is for like, you know, your every girl who loves beauty uh, to like serve and look nice always. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you definitely give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.